So my research is focused on Māori mental health wellbeing and looking at the experiences of Māori in acute inpatient mental health services. I looked at the factors that um, inhibit recovery or make it more difficult for people to get uh, to get well within the hospital setting. Things such as seclusion and restraint, which are quite common for Māori. What we did find is that when people were secluded or locked away in a room in isolation, or when they were restrained, which involves physical hands-on restraint, um, that that um, impacted on recovery significantly because it resulted in re-traumatisation. So it was common for Māori service users who accessed hospital to say that um, they felt more traumatised, um, expressed extremely negative emotions and just a significant increase in distress. There were some um, really clear indicators of things that supported recovery and enhanced well-being. So these were things like um, access to cultural supports within services, so there's specific um, Māori support teams who would come into admissions that would ultimately reduce the risk or need for seclusion and restraint to be imposed upon people. Future research would focus on um, enhancing therapeutic environments for Māori specifically, so there um, was a lot of evidence to support Kaupapa Māori or Māori specific programs for when people are distressed. The cultural support was something, a significant factor that enhanced wellbeing. So it would be really helpful to look at how we might be able to enhance services nationally with similar type support.